Hello everyone. Today I will introduce the seed point based ground point classification function. First, we need to open the classification editor function. On the top menu bar of the LiDAR 360 main interface, click on the classification menu, find the classification editor tool, and click to open it. Before performing seed point based ground point classification, the point cloud data needs to be partitioned. Click the Partition button to complete the partitioning process. Next, find the Classification Tools module in the menu bar, click on the drop-down menu, and select any tool from the filter. Then click to open it. In the pop-up window, choose the Seed Point Selection tool. A new parameter setting window will appear. You can select the method for choosing points, such as the closest point, lowest point, or highest point. You can also set the size of the within and the range. After completing the settings, you will notice that when the cursor is placed over the data, a small circle appears. The size of the circle corresponds to the within size you set. Click the left mouse button to apply the classification change, and the affected area will be determined by the range you set. Once you've completed the necessary classification edits, click Save Results to finish the classification. That concludes the entire process of using the seed point based ground point classification function. Thank you for watching.